Jesus was searching for places that were more silent to have an encounter with God. In today's Gospel, we find Jesus curing many people. Thereafter, all those wonderful moments, we find Jesus hunting after places that are bleak and desolate right before the dawn. Or in other words, Jesus was searching for places that were more silent to have an encounter with God. The moment we search for silence in our Christian life, it enters into a next notch in life. Definitely, this silence is peace. The silence is the presence of God. Or rather, it is only in the presence of God our hearts can find the true silence. Unfortunately, there is the evil force which makes us 24-7 occupied and in that way never letting us to discern the voice of God in silence. Our life, nature, everything has a rhythm, a speed. The moment when we are not moving along with this speed or rhythm, there happens the catastrophe. Of course, it would entice you, but it won't travel with you longer. Once upon a time, there was a missionary. He was traveling towards an island. The moment he reached the island, he was welcomed by three monks. He spoke to them. Thereafter, the missionary found out that these monks are not do not know the basis, basic prayers, neither the catechism. He looked down upon them, but patiently he taught them the prayers. Later, when the missionary started his voyage back towards his home, he found three of these missionaries running over the waters coming towards his ship. They asked him, Dear Father, we just forgot it. The prayers could he teach us once again. The missionary was wonderstruck. It was then he realized how small was his faith. Dear friends, in our life, there are times where we have kept our career, our families, our responsibilities, psychology, our institutions, or our responsibilities above God. We have not, we have failed to give first place to God. The person who really respects God would naturally give prior place to God and prayer. May Christ, who has challenged us to find God in silence, make us go forward and to find silence in our heart. May Christ bless us all. Amen.